Hi guys! Today I'm here to do the closet confidential tag. I wasn't really tagged by anyone in particular, but I saw my pal Hannah Yep do it this week and I was like, I've seen that tag going around and I kind of like it. So I thought I would do it today. First question is, what is your oldest item? Um, and my oldest item that I still have, um, if I can get it out of this pile, my newspaper sweatshirt, um, or our sweatshirt from junior year, um, and there was a typo. It says Outtook. That's the best story ever. Uh, my name's on the back of it, though. My name's First. First. This was what we got as our, um, our sweatshirts in 11th grade. Whoever we, we got it from did a shitty job, because it's like they just took a regular hoodie and then just put a zipper in it, so it's like big and bulky and awkward, um, but it's warm. That's helpful. And we got to show our school pride without actually wearing school colors because the outlook, we didn't give a fuck. Number two is the newest items. And I have two that I got at the same time. These bad boys I picked up from Urban Exchange. Um, they're dirty on the bottom. They're literally fucking sequins. Um, Sam Edelman uh, Jazz Oxfords. They're sequined. Oh my god. I saw them at Urban Exchange and I was like, they're $40. They probably won't fit me. And I put them on and I'm like, they fit me. So I bought these. Um, I had store credit. And then the same day, I bought this sweater that I featured in my last outfit of the day. Um, my big ass long uh, cardigan from Campus Casuals. This big duster cardigan that is literally super super long. I'll put a link to that outfit of the day video below if you hadn't seen it yet. This I got the same day as my sequin shoes and um, they're, they're second hand. So they're newest but also not new. Huh. Number three, most expensive item. Most expensive item. This was most definitely my, my most expensive item. Um, I think I think it was like $80, but I got it for Christmas. Um, but it's from Topshop, so like they're expensive and shit. But I I love this. I love this so much. I also featured this in an outfit of the day a little while ago. Not this last one, obviously, but the one before it. Um, but it's velvet, and there's fringe. Crushed fucking velvet with mesh and fringe like how much more fucking trendy could I get most affordable item this t-shirt cuz I got it for free I got it as a gift from the cellar door last year I love free things biggest bargain I really liked this question because I am a thrifting fanatic I go garage sailing with my mom and we find some cool shit but the biggest bargain that I have is this vintage Mondi um, jacket. I like to call it my Michael Jackson jacket. I think my mom got it for like 10 bucks at a flea market a couple years ago. But look at this, look at this thing. Look at it, look at it. It's beautiful, it has all the buttons. All of the buttons. It's really warm, it fits me flawlessly. I, oh my god, I, I think I did an outfit of the day with this on my blog last year. I should I should wear it soon again. I haven't really worn it that much this winter, but I really like the detail on the Mandarin collar. Um, it's just, it's awesome, and it's vintage, and I fucking, I love it so much. I'm like, never giving that thing away ever, because it's just so perfect. Like, ah. Oh. And then my biggest waste of money are these Ham Edelmans um, that I bought off eBay last year. I think I paid like $60 for these. I've worn them like three times. Like they're really, really cute. Like they're really, really cute. But when the fuck am I going to wear these? Why did I buy them? I don't know. Like, I think I just really wanted a pair of like wedges, like really fucking like high. These are like five inches. So I need to wear them a lot more to get my $60 worth. I need to wear them 57 more times. Those are all the questions. There weren't that many. Um, I thought this was a quick little tag. I liked it. I'm taking this sweatshirt off because it's warm. Today's song of the day, though, oh shit, um, is... Today's song of the day is Altered Beast by Kifkin. 
Um, they're playing on KEXP next month, and um, I'm seeing their side project open for Ravenna Woods this weekend, but their new song, Altered Beast, is currently like streaming on like MTVU and then Bandcamp, but it's really, really great. Um, if you liked the song that was on my last playlist that was the Kipkin song, this one's also awesome. There's lots of drumming and chanting and screaming. So go listen to that song if you haven't heard Kipkin before. Um, they're named after little hobbit-like creatures in Magic the Gathering. So that's nerdy as fuck. Otherwise, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!